Well, I got a message from Animal Control, and they had a husky there who um, has been paralyzed since birth. He's been scooting around on these legs, probably has never seen a vet. So I want to get him up to West Virginia, to my vet. I know that my rescue is full. I rescue first and ask questions later. <laughs> He's a few years old, so he's been around. I don't know his vet stats or anything like that. I really do hope that this is big enough for this kid. I don't know how big he is, but I mean, we can put the seat down if we need to. But I have no idea if I'm gonna have to carry him. Obviously, I can't leash walk him. So this must be animal control. Yeah, if you need to, you can just pick him up and put him in my car. He'll be fine once I've got him. Oh, yeah. It's all right. Can I feel your bones? You're a little bit skinny. A little bit skinny. You're peeing on stuff. I think we're gonna go diapers for this boy. I can help you lift. Oh, he's got sores on his feet. He's not even three years old. He has every right to live as much as the rest of them. With the amount of dogs out there that are homeless and the amount of dogs that are dying every day for space, it might be better to, to you know, protect the ones that are more, um, more adoptable, but this one is like he's only a few years old and he deserves that protection from us as well all right we are here hello dude meet scooter <laughs> I gotcha. I gotcha. Already got somebody wants him. Buddy. He's hungry, so we're gonna grab him something to eat. We just got back and we got him in his wheelchair. He's getting tired already uh, and he's pretty hungry, so we're gonna take it off of him and let him rest and get some water. All right, buddy, we are going to give you a bath, get you some medicine, and get you set up for the night. You're gonna feel so good. We'll get you a blanket, we'll get you all set. And tomorrow we'll make plans to go see Dr. Carl in West Virginia. 